Yes, more pancakes. Let's go ahead and register. They're gonna be like, you are too old for school, sir. Please exit the campus. Oh, I got cake, nigiri, and a donut. I'm gonna stick with Eric. I, I do like Eric. Always nonchalant, never judgmental. Always a friend in there for you when you need him. I appreciate you, Eric. You're a good guy. Never change. 493 centimeters. What the heck is a centimeter? It's talking about setting up battle and unifying Japan, so I don't really know. <laughs> Times were troubled within the school. Eraser flicking spread far and wide. In the middle of it all, one young man was brave enough to step through the school gates and face it. This summer, fight for unity. The blockbuster event of the summer theater near you i'm just an eraser a simple eraser fool battling against the noodle chief hello everyone welcome back to nindy nexus the channel for everything nintendo indie my name is mikey and today we're doing another first look today we're gonna do a game that i've had in my backlog for a while that i've been meaning to get to and i just haven't because you know how the backlog is. It's called Our Flick Erasers. It's on the North American eShop for the oddest price that I've probably ever seen, uh, even though it's an even number technically. $12.96. The release date was August 2nd, 2019. So it is a little bit older. Uh, and the publisher is Satbox with a hyphen in the middle, S-A-T-B-O-X. It is up to four players and it's listed as an action party application puzzle game. Game file size 1.1 GB and supported languages are English. Uh, rated E for everyone. So let's get into our Flick Erasers, see what it's all about. It comes highly recommended to a friend of mine on Twitter and it's it looks awesome actually. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. It's, uh, it reminds me of something I would do back in school where you kind of... Um, put together some contraption and basically fight other th contraptions uh, by knocking it into each other. At least that's what I gathered from the screenshots. Um, we used to play all kinds of things in school. I remember we used to play with the paper footballs. Um, that was probably my favorite game. And I think, I don't quote me on this, but I think I did see a game like that on the eShop too that I may have to look into after this. Uh, but first off, um, this starting menu is is actually very high quality uh, Very Very good art. I, I rather enjoy that. So we're gonna press any button to start. So welcome to the world of our flick erasers Must be the main character there Are you familiar with flick erasers? The game is really trending right now. Huh? I didn't know the rules are simple. Take turns flicking your erasers and knock your opponents off first to win. All right. So far, so good. Oh, so taking us straight into a tutorial. I like that. I will explain the controls to you. Try them along with me. Let's first learn how to flick while pressing ZR, X, ZR, ZR and X, Z, I, <laughs> those are two different buttons. So I don't know if I'm supposed to hold them together. We'll find out. Decide the strength and direction of the flick. Releasing the ZRX button will flick the eraser. Uh, okay, so it's ZR or X. I'm gonna use ZR because it's got a little bit of a little bit more room to to press. You know what I mean? It's it's got some room to travel. And adjust the strength in the direction with the L stick. So here's ZR. Uh, I don't see ZR doing anything. I think, okay, there's no notification that it's happening, but I am pressing ZR right now. Uh, let, me, let me try X and C real quick, just in case. Uh, nope, okay, so ZR. Adjust the strength and direction with the L stick. So you can um, pull it down to, to give it more strength and then rotate it around to obviously change the direction and then release ZR. And there we go. So that was full strength, um, as straight as I can get it. And it traveled basically the whole length of the table there. You did it, keep it up. Try adding a spin to your flick. Adding a spin increases the distance. Okay. So try adding a right spin while pressing A or R, decide the strength and the direction. Releasing AR, okay. 
So let's go ahead and try R this time. And then, uh, okay, so it gives you a notification that it is a spin. I do like that. Um, I wonder if it is to the left or if that is just a general notation that it's just a spin. So I'm gonna release R and it, it travels a little bit further. I mean, it wasn't a huge difference, but I think in the right scenario, it would probably make a bigger difference. You're a natural. I'll show you how to add a right spin. Okay, so that was that was a, a left spin. Okay, and pressing Y or L. So L, L, and then back gives it a right spin. I mean, it's kind of opposite of what I would expect, I think, but that's okay. And there we go. There's a left, or I'm sorry, a right spin with the L button. And then touch controls, you can play on the touch screen to play on tabletop mode or handheld mode. It's as simple as touching the screen, sliding your finger and releasing it. So it does have touch screen options. Obviously I'm not playing touch screen right now because I got to record. Uh, but you touch screen with your finger, flick the eraser by sliding and then releasing your finger. So it's kind of like you were doing it in real life, sort of. Sliding your finger along the right side will add a right spin. Doing a left side will give a left spin. And that's it for explanations. Lastly, put what you learned to the test. So it looks like we're probably gonna battle someone. Yep, and there it is. So let's go ahead and um, let's go full force. Why not? Full force straight into him. Boom. There we go. Okay. Nice. So I'm liking this. I think I'm gonna put a little bit of a left spin on it. See. Oh boy, we both fell off, but he hit the ground first. Okay, so I can't fall off the table. I didn't expect to. Um, I thought I was just going to knock him off and then, I don't know, work like pool, you know, have mine stay on and his fly off, but I guess not. Full force. This might knock me off. Ooh, that was so close. Uh, let's go ahead and try the spin again. There we go. Oh, I like that it landed on the chair and just didn't go straight through it. And someone uh, paid attention to the physics of the surrounding objects as well, not just the the direct uh, foreground here. So that's nice. You did it. You knocked off your opponent's. You knocked off your opponent's eraser off the desk. Check out the other modes. Bonus content: party pack, six member support added to Flicky Racers. Uh, playing single mode with friends, 10 new stages, 10 new stages, 10,000 points. Yeah, I'm going to hold off on that for now. And we're going to try one uh, of the single player matches. Defeat, battled by defeating opponents one after another and flick funny racer. There are a ton of fun challenges. Clear them for rewards. Try not to fall off or try not to fall in flicky racer. Keep attacking to achieve the greatest distance you can. Okay, so um, I'm just gonna try. I'm just gonna try. Uh, well, we saw we saw the battle. I'm gonna try the challenge mode real quick. So make your way through some challenges here. So they they provide different modes in the game, which is nice. It's not just the battle, and it looks like actually there's there's a fair amount of challenges. There's uh, 20 pages worth of challenges. Look at that. That's impressive actually, 240 different challenge courses. That's pretty good, not gonna lie. Uh, let's go ahead and try the first one, just um, start at the beginning there. So we're gonna knock over the pencil. So actually these challenge levels probably give you a pretty good insight into controlling the eraser. And that's not a bad thing. And so I know from the tutorial that I could go full strength on that and I wouldn't fly off. Um, but that's cool. Uh, I think that this is good probably to start with. Put the soccer ball in the goal. So this, um, I don't know if it's still an eraser, but this is actually round. So uh, I imagine it's gonna travel further. Yep, into the goal. So they give you different options or different objects to use. 
and to um, try and complete whatever goal they give you. Look at that, pancakes, ladybug, and a Valentine's candy. What do they call them, sweethearts? It's a random mix. Pass to the other side. And this looks like a lemon, and it doesn't look like it's very friendly with rolling straight forward, but I'll give it a go. Yep, okay, it worked. Enough strength and we're good. Yes, more pancakes. All right, let's try one more challenge. Uh, defeat the pencils, those evil, evil pencils. All right. Look at that, segregated, oppressed. Let's, uh, let's try this here. There we go, there's one. And it's still on me attacking me uh, let's see if I can get that oh so close I'm gonna need just a little bit of strength here let's give it a little spin because why not uh, just a little bit there we go that was perfect exactly what I needed oh wait what happened uh, retry do I need to do it in two strokes it said I had three one that was only two, <laughs> uh, well, at least by my count. One, oh, cause I, I got it. Yeah, I didn't make it all the way. Oh, that's that's actually kind of tough. Cause look at that, pencils in the way, blocking my way. All right, so I'm gonna have to try a different strategy. I'm gonna go straight for the red pencil first and then make my way that way. Oh, whoops, I went to the next one. Uh, all right, well, let's just do this one real quick. Pass to the other side. I just It's just about timing on this one. It's pretty fast, so I'm gonna have to go right now. Oh, no. Man, this is tough. I'm only on challenge two and three. All right, let's try Let's go back to challenge two again. Real, uh, wait, that was a soccer ball, Never mind. Three and four is what I meant to say. Um, all right, let's just do that real fast because it's easy. Oh, I got cake, nigiri, and a donut. That's right. Okay. Um, challenge four was the pencils. There we go. That's, oh, did my main character change or what's going on here? Uh, Okay, so let's go red pencils first. Red pencils first. Oh my goodness, and I missed. I can't even, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it now, but we'll try. Hit that spare, hit that spare. Nope, didn't get it. All right, we're gonna retry. I'm gonna get this before the video's over. Let's actually, um, let me put a spin on it. I think that's going to be the better option here. Oh no! Oh man, it deflected my attack. Alright, let's see if I can get both in one go then. Oh, and I missed both. Terrible shot. Oh my goodness. He's so surprised. He had faith in me and I let him down. Alright, let's try one more time. I know I can get it. I got faith. Let's get a slight angle. Oh man, but it's blocking me. How do I? All right, let's give it a spin. Nope. 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 Man, it's actually <laughs> it's actually tougher than it looks. All right, I swear. Last try. We're doing it. One more time. What if I go blue first and just go diagonal? Well, I don't even know if it's gonna reach that far though. That's the problem. Okay, <clears throat> let's try it. Come on, genius. Oh my goodness. No. Oh man. All right, can, I wonder if I can get, can I get blue and yellow maybe in the same one? I need to get two in the same one. It's not happening. All right, well. It didn't even wanna go down, look at that. Oh well. <laughs> so that that was the second mode there 
Um, I'm gonna try the last mode real quick, uh, just to show you, or at least the last single player mode, I should say. And then I'll show you a couple of the options and then we'll call it a day because I don't want this video to run too, too long. But you enjoy, or uh, hopefully you're enjoying this and you deserve to see everything that this game has to offer. Always nonchalant, Eric Eraser. He's <laughs> Eric Eraser. I'm gonna stick with Eric, I, I do like Eric. Always nonchalant, never judgmental, always a friend in there for you when you need them. I appreciate you, Eric. You're a good guy. Never change. All right, so single flicky eraser. It's the Y button to do a dash attack, B button to jump, left stick to move. We got some items to collect. Use the erasers to keep pushing forward. How far will you be able to go? So Y is dash, B is jump. Y is dash, B is jump. We got time, don't get the skull coin, get the A, and get the transforming tonic. Okay, I think I got this. Let's do it. Got this. Coins, coins, coins. A, we want the A. Oh, there we go, we want to dash, we want to jump. Oh man, this is like an actual legit course here. Uh. Can I, oh, can you walk across those? Oh, you can. Ah, okay. I got it. I thought I had to jump that, but I was missing the coin, so. Let's, let's redo it. 493 centimeters. What the heck is a centimeter? All right, so let's try this again. I'm gonna retry, I'm gonna get a higher score. Gonna do this, have to do this. Doing it for you, Eric. Let's go. Dodging straight through. Oh no, I missed one. There we go. Can do it. Two coins. Hop that gap. Let's go. Oh no, the cars attack you. I trusted you vehicles. Uh, all right. There we go, nice. Nice. Use the dash to give me a little extra boost there. Hopefully uh, I don't need one right here, cause uh, there we go. Oh, I don't want those coins. Hmm. Hitting the glue sticks, sorry Elmers. Oh boy. Wait, was that a time limit? The angle is a little bit hard to see there. I did make it further. That's actually pretty fun. I like that. <laughs> All right, let's go back to the mode select. And uh, I'm gonna see, we got a mysterious classroom. We got many games, we got all kinds of stuff. This is a lot of, seems like a lot of content. I'm actually really glad I decided to pick this one up. Uh, it's a mysterious classroom. You might find something rare in the desks. So I can just, oh, use points that you earn to pull. So one is 500, five is 2200, I have 47. Let's try one, see what happens. Choose one of the four desks, and I get to choose the desk. Yes, all right, here we go. Bottom right, come on, don't let me down. Oh, what is that? What is that? Grab it by the arm and throw it. I don't know what that is, it looks like a claw or like a something I don't know all right um, it's, it's a normal one let's try and see if we can find a rare one let's try a top left come on no whammy I've got a fire truck heck yes I wonder why fire trucks are red all right I love it and it's a special one so I'm, I'm happy with that let's go ahead and go back and uh, customize, create, oh, you can create your own eraser, man, customize and create your own personal eraser, you can choose erasers that you created from the customize tab, this is awesome, all right, let's create that, oh, and you get a little preview, this kind of reminds me a little bit, the grid anyway, and the preview of, uh, Animal Crossing, so, let's go with, 
Um, let's go with my my buddy Eric here and center him and see if I can get some interesting stuff. I'm kind of liking this idea. Maybe I can do like a little. Uh, can I rotate this? Tell me I can rotate it or invert it. Yes, little like um, kind of rocket ship looking deal here. Put a little couple guns on it maybe, or a single, double. Yeah, it looks a little bit long. I wonder if I can. Oh, you can stand it up. What? That's cool. Uh, I'm not gonna stand that one up. Um, I think. Uh, I wanna. Can, can I? I can't rotate it though. Hmm. Oh, ZR to turn. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. I don't know if that's gonna hold me down with some like wind resistance or whatever, like something on the desk. But whatever. Let's go with what looks with what looks good. Boom. I like that. Okay, and then I need something back there connecting the wings. Something that's uh, something that's gonna look good. What else do I got? Can I can I do can I do anything else? Any other options, items? I probably have to unlock them because it says number of available parts 715 down there. So I'm guessing that's probably what it is. Um, I want how much is a sock? Yep. There we go. I found it. We're doing the soccer ball. Now, do I leave a gap or do I connect it? I'm going to connect it. There we go. And the finished product. Look at that preview. There we go. I'm going to confirm it. Let's register it. How do I register it? Confirm. A. No. Nope. That's nope. Not a glue stick. Uh, if I press B, I don't want to lose it. Can I? Um, plus is to change colors, so I can change the colors. That's kind of cool. Oh, look, there's a like a tennis ball. I do like the soccer ball, so I'm gonna keep that. But they got a baseball, basketball, tennis ball. Uh, what was that a racket ball? Or I'm not sure. I'm not sure what that one is. Look, that one looks like a ping pong ball. All right, so that's pretty cool. Let's. Okay, I'm just gonna press B, and if it works, then it works. Uh, save and go back. Yep. So it does allow you to save by just pressing B. It is registered. Beautiful. A little rocket ship. Okay, and let's try um, <laughs> to, to unify Japan. Wait, what? <laughs> Um, let's try the mini games real quick. This video is going to run a little bit longer than I anticipated, but that's okay. Roll the baseball eraser to get a home run. You get points in the process. You can try to roll it every three hours. What? So aim carefully. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't know. Do I, I just press A. Do I actually move it while it's going? Because I, I can't. I can't aim it or do anything here, so I'm just gonna uh, press A. Oh, okay. There, okay, it's the same controls as the erasers. Got it. All right, let's put a spin on it though. I think, uh, I'm, I'm liking going this way with a spin on the right, and we'll see how this works. I don't know how thick this thing is, so we'll find out. Oh, knocked him over. All right, as a triple, as a as a reward for your first time playing, you get an amazing baseball eraser. So I got this. That's cool. Hit triple. Okay, that and I can only do it once every three hours. I wonder if it's like actually three hours. Oh, it is. It's real time. Three hours. Oh wow. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, they told me. I didn't know what else to expect. Uh, stage is set. So there's one last mode here. Well, technically multiplayer mode. But one last mode uh, called Unity. And 
I really don't know what's going on here. It's talking about setting up battle and unifying Japan, so I don't really know. Uh, unify. Okay, let's unify. Start. This is serious. This is like the. Uh, this is like a story mode. Times were troubled within the school. Eraser flicking spread far and wide. In the middle of it all, one young man was brave enough to step through the school gates and face it. This summer, the blockbuster event of the summer. Fight for unity in a theater near you. Oh man, rip theaters. All right, let's uh, <laughs> let's do this. I'm gonna choose my favorite eraser. You know, oh, do I go with my custom eraser, or do I go with the one that I won? Man, there's a lot of erasers to get. Look at that. Some secret erasers. How do I choose custom? Can I go down? Oh, I can. Look at these. And I can use the nigiri. What? Oh, man. I'm going to use my custom one because I trust it. Trust it with my life. Title, beginner. Can I change it? Oh. Eh. Yep. Let's go ahead and put my name in real quick. Boom for the brand. E A E S. There we go. Oh, wait. <laughs> My name's supposed to go right here. That was the title. Uh, let's see. Uh, eraser. Eraser Fool. Let's put a let's put a hyphen in there. Eraser fool, erasery fool, eraser fool. Takumi that reminds me of initial D. Tack. Um, S N E S. There we go. Eraser fool, Mikey Sness. Hometown Iwate. Iwate. Uh, oh, okay. Get to choose. Fukushima. Um, let's go with Miyagi. And age. I am 29. 29 year old eraser fool. Favorite subject home economics. I wonder what that matters. Uh, how do I get down there though? It's not letting me down. Oh, there we go. Um, actually, my favorite was always art, if, uh, being honest there, art. Let's go ahead and register. They're gonna be like, you are too old for school, sir. Please exit the campus. Let's defeat erasers waiting for each prefecture and aim at unification in the world. It's better to take two battles ahead. By the way, if you lose, troops decrease by one. When all troops decrease, it will be reworked from the beginning of the region where it is then. Defeat various erasers all over Japan to once again unify the land. Choose prefecture to conquer. My base. Um, I guess. What are we playing for? Ramen? Or what is that? Some udon? All right. My turn. <laughs> um, <laughs> that refreshing, <laughs> that refreshing soy sauce taste. I'm versing the noodle chief. Oh boy, I'm just an eraser, a simple eraser fool, battling against the noodle chief. I'm on unstable ground, my friends. <laughs> All right, I got. It. Eraser, duck eraser on a pencil, and I wonder if I can knock that soccer ball into uh, Commander, Commander uh, um, Noodle over there. Nope. 
Didn't work. Ah, he's playing difficult, I see. Unstable ground again. I'm really hoping he rolls off. That'd be awesome. Yep, he rolls right over me. Get out of bounds. I call that a win, boys. All right. The eraser fool. Looking not so foolish right now. There we go. Captured a new territory. And I got the ramen eraser. It was ramen. I thought so. Uh, acquired a, a thousand P and the enemy's eraser. Oh, so you play for keeps in this one. All right. So uh, that's going to do it for our look at our flick erasers. Like I said, it is $12.96 on the North American eShop published by Sat Box, up to four players. And uh, pretty interesting. I'm going to say that I like it. I don't normally share my feelings uh, in a first look, but I can see myself really enjoying this one and, and playing quite a bit through it. Uh, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the thumbs up. If you didn't, go ahead and hit the thumbs down. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to visit us at Nindy nexus.net can't talk right now uh for more great nindy content we got lots of reviews opinions news all kinds of good stuff so um that's gonna do it you all have a great evening and i will see you in the next one